Hello and welcome to Don't Stop Wrestling Chat. This is your first video of the day, NXT review. Um, NXT was okay. Uh, let's get into the review, guys. Before we do, don't forget to hit like, hit subscribe, and hit that notification bell. Your support literally means the world to me. And yeah, it literally means the world to me. If I could explain it in somehow the, the way it, it makes me feel, I would try. But um, That'd probably be harder. <laughs> right, guys, let's get into this review. So, NXT, like I said, it was okay. Nothing special. We kicked off with a street fight with Brazango and Isaiah Scott versus Fantasma. I do, still don't know how to say the first part. Uh, this was like 11 minutes. It was 3.5 stars. It was a very good match, guys. Six-man tag was actually really good. It was wild. They had so much going on and a lot of action crammed into like, the period that they had, but um, was really good. Then when Candice Lil Ray versus Casey, Candice picked up the win, three minutes, mostly a squash match, but uh, yeah, not going to give this a rating, it was a squash match. Backstage, we get Rhea Ripley, cuts a promo, saying she want, she's sick of Mercedes, Mercedes Martinez and Robert Stone. Uh, to handle this, she challenges Martinez to a steel cage match, which I think will be pretty good if she accepts. We get Bronson Reed versus Timothy Thatcher. Two minutes here. This had potential to be something better than what it was, but again, because of that Iron Man coming later in the night, it's been crammed. And I feel that was the same with this whole show. The Iron Man coming later in the night, so what they done was they had to cram everything out at the start. It was always quite short, simple, like... I gave this two stars, but next it's Mercedes Martinez accepts um, Rhea's challenge for next week. Like, that's literally the start of the sh That was the whole show. And then you had the Iron Man match, which was NXT Championship Iron Man match. Adam Cole versus Finn Balor versus Johnny Gargano versus Tomasa Campa. Champa? Campa? However you say his name. I like this guy because he's bald and bearded, just like me. Uh, <laughs> Um, yeah, guys, this one really was like, it felt, obviously they had enough time to do stuff. It, it, was a, it was a good match. It just wasn't great. They got everything they wanted in. The, the pace was pretty good. Everybody got their, their wee time to shine. Only thing I didn't like really was the finish. I feel it was pointless to have this match then. If the finish was going to be Finn Balor, Adam Cole, um, next week anyway. Because William Regal comes out and he says uh, Balor will face Cole next week. And the first fall gets the title. So I gave this a three stars, guys. Now, I think that's a little bit high for what it was. It could probably be a 2.5. But um, I don't know. It just really didn't feel like it worked. It just felt like it was a good match. Go watch the match. There's nothing wrong with it. It just felt like it could have been better. Like, I mean, this could have literally been a four or five star match. Right, guys, overall, I gave the whole show three stars. Like I say, it was a, it was a good week for NXT. The Iron Man, I just think, just took up too much of the show. It, I get what they were doing, but see if they, obviously, if they kept that for a pay-per-view, it would have took up too much of the pay-per-view. But I feel in a pay-per-view, they could have done, like, they would have had a little bit more to do, like they would have had a little bit more um, things they could have done to progress, but it was good for what it was, it was nothing special, and we all know it's hard to pull off an Iron Man match, Iron Man matches are really, really hard to pull off, um, I think what well, Brett and Sean was probably one of the best ones ever, but um, there is a lot they could have done here that... Um, would have helped this get better. I've just realised I said um, like eight times there. <laughs> There's a possibility this could have been a five star match, guys, but it wasn't. It was three stars at best, and it really makes you wonder if if they're going to. I get what's going to happen next week, but if the other people when the the match come out an attack, they interrupt, they all get held back and it leads on to some sort of cage match or 
I don't know, but like, I really think like something could have been done better here. And to kick off, even if it's to kick off like a four man food kind of thing, to kick it off in an Iron Man match is a pretty weird way of doing it. But um yeah, it was okay guys, it was nothing special, like I says. And I still enjoyed it. I'd recommend you go watch it. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna love you and leave you here, guys. I'm gonna go record the impact review as well. Watch um <laughs> so you get a double upload today don't forget to hit like, hit subscribe and hit that notification bell your support literally means a bunch to me and I'll see you here well, when the next video gets uploaded for you, might be a couple of hours but it's going to be like 10 minutes for me so I'll see you when, when I do that <laughs> enjoy the rest of your day guys